Now at 6, IMPD making changes to try to address a shortage of officers on the force. CBS 4's Russ McQuaid shows us how the department is pushing the limits to hire more officers and get them to the street faster. IMPD has enough money on hand to hire 1,843 officers to patrol streets like here in Hawville. As of today, there are 1,554 men and women wearing the IMPD badge, which means IMPD has to streamline its application process to put recruits through the academy faster. A scenario village is being constructed at IMPD's Eastside Training Academy to better train officers in a real world environment. Crews are also remodeling classrooms inside the academy to increase the number of recruits who can be trained in a year. The IMPD recruit application process will now reopen every four months in order to expedite the application process and increase the number of recruits that come here to the academy. This modification means that three classes will start here at our academy in 2023. IMPD found it took too long to do all the testing for recruits and some applicants either moved on or found another police department that could hire them quicker. Why can't we offer a written test, an oral interview board and a physical fitness test in one day instead of waiting for a large class to be graduated in the spring and a large class to be graduated in the winter. IMPD has been filming commercials about recruiting and soon viewers will see TV spots in Indianapolis and across the region to encourage applications, though Chief Randall Taylor says standards haven't been lowered in the chase to put more bodies in seats at the academy. Well, we're holding the line on things like felonies. Uh, if you got a felony, not going to work out. Um, there are a few misdemeanors that could be considered, maybe minor driving offenses or something like along that line. Right now, IMPD has 26 recruits in training at its academy. Every year, it can lose up to 100 officers to retirement or separation. Now, if IMPD has two more classes this year of 40 officers apiece, that means by the end of the year, the new officers will effectively cancel out the old officers leaving, but it really won't add to the force. In Hawville at IMPD Southwest District Headquarters, Russ McQuaid, CBS 4 News. A bill